So, in case you don't know, I've tr I've done clickbait before. I'm going to say that before. I've done some different types of clickbait, just like things that people... Well, it's not real clickbait, it, but it's just um, doing things that are popular at the time, which isn't really that clickbait. Clickbait is where you do something that's... You do something that, um, like in the thumbnail or in the text, in the title, that will get someone to watch it immediately. And then they don't get what they want. Some people call my Zelda video a clickbait, but the reason that I say that I disagree with that is because the Zelda video was, I just got false information for that. I just didn't, I, my friend told me, I'm not bashing on my friend, but he told me like this tactic of how to get, um, stuff, how to get like, uh, fix all your items on Zelda. And I guess it just, I didn't understand it. But this guy, Derv, I just, there are no words to describe him. There is nothing, there is nothing that makes this, this okay. So what am I talking about? Well, Derv, he is a channel with almost 1.5 million subscribers. And you know how he got that? First of all, I know how he got that in the beginning of all of his videos. He said, all right, guys, if you want a free giveaway of gift cards, subscribe. And it skyrocketed, and that's how everyone, every, everywhere is subscribing to him. But a lot, I'd say maybe 98% of all of his videos are clickbait. So let's look at some of the um, some of the videos that are clickbait. Calling Jesus, 1-888-888, OMG, he answered. Calling the devil, he answered, 666. Scariest killer clown sightings ever. In the most insane water bottle flip flipping ever calling a killer clown he actually answered omg creepy candy man challenge gone wrong the killer clown calls me calls me back omg so creepy killer clown killer clown killer clown anyways he keeps going about you must try these crazy siri tricks 92 percent of you will fail if you see a dog you're colorblind calling the evil santa claus charge iphone to 100 percent instantly life hacks 20p challenge gone horribly wrong. Never have I ever kissed a girl. Hot chili, I hot sauce, and then it keeps, keeps, keeps going on until it gets out of hand. The video that all my friends get a um, joke about is the fact that he made a video about I FaceTimed the boss baby and he actually answered, Oh Yeah, he made that video. He's also made videos today like, which fidget spinner is different? Can you see the yellow fidget spinners in 30 seconds? 3% of you can't see a fidget spinner. Can you? Yeah. But the thing that I find inexcusable about Derv is the video he made saying, I held my breath for 24 hours legit. I've never seen such clickbait. And... The thing is, Der your videos, all of them pretty much, are just straight up to, for clicks. And the thing is, YouTube's algorithm isn't even for clicks now. It's just for view retention, which is not, is not like any, is not how it works anymore. So, one other clickbait mention that I want to mention is that he made a video saying, Hi, me in 10 years, made 10 years ago. He joined on July 2nd of 2016. Yep. Derv, all your videos. Like, I found the boss baby. Calling Freddy Fazbury came to my house hunting for the boss baby. Kids is back, flipped to impress for all. Goes wrong. Coming out to my dad. I can rap faster than Eminem. Yeah. I'm deleting this video forever in 24. Yep. Yeah, I. Derv. Impossible mind trick test. 93% fail. You need to come. You need to stop out with it. You need to stop with this. Because all of your videos, pretty much all of them, because the Shadow Sunday ones are okay. They're still kind of corny, but whatever. Your clickbait videos, what even is the point? What What is the point in just getting people to watch the video? I don't just watch the video for, um, just because they like your advertising to make them think like something. Because that's not even how YouTube works anymore. That's not even how you get money from, or like, if you even care about like getting money if you just want to just get like big on YouTube because I assume that he's making knowing Derv he's probably making 
I he's he's clearly not making a lot of money because if he was, then he wouldn't be doing clickbait because it clickbait is not how you get money anymore. But Durv, what is your goal? What is your final goal with all this clickbait? Just to get a bunch of people to hate you? Because that's what you're doing. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave your thoughts on this in the comment section below. And see you.